Hey guys, Professor Bell, Comic Book University, and X-23, issue number one. Okay, so a brand new series is starting. She's X-23 again. Yay! <laughs> she, I understand why she would have been Wolverine for a little while, but, you know, not really. Just stop that. So, two, birth, two birthdays and three funerals. That's kind of freaking weird. You're gonna, we're gonna get to that in just a moment. Uh, you know what? Why not? Let's just get right to it right now. It has to do with the Cuckoo Sisters. So three funerals, hmm, but two birthdays. What? So the 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 sisters wind up bringing back the um their two sisters who died. Yeah, Sophie and uh, and Esme. So wait, Sophie. I can't remember all their names. Anyway, it doesn't matter. All right. The idea is that wow. So this is about as freaky as freaky gets. They cloned their sisters and brought them back, but cloning is hard, as they point out. Oh, this is weird. There was a really awkward meeting between Gabby and Laura and the, the three surviving uh, Cuckoo sisters. It was really, really, really awkwardly weird. Oh, wow, one of the worst. But the rest of the comic, for the most of the part, was actually really good. And I don't know where they're going with this. Um, good luck, wherever they're going. But I like I like that uh, Beast is trying to help out Laura. And by default, Gabby also. This is fun. Uh, the comic made me a little bit mad at one point. Because uh, uh, Gabby wanted a, a pretzel. You know one of those hot pretzels? And I'm just saying, it's like 2.15, right? Yeah, exactly, 2.15 in the a.m. here, and, uh, you know, while I'm recording this video, and, and there's no place that's going to be open that's got hot pretzels. No place. So, I'm sitting here in the middle of the night, wishing that I had a hot pretzel, and freaking Gabby's eating a hot pretzel. I'm mad. I hate this comic book. I hate this comic book. You want me to hate the comic book even more? They go to a place called Falafel Mania or Marvel Falafel, which should definitely be a real franchise. But the guy inside is wearing a Falafel Mania 23 uh, TV. That, that was actually a good WrestleMania. Anyway, like, dude, are you are you kidding me right here? And, and there's no place around that's open that has Falafel. So I'm really mad at this comic book. I'm joking. This was actually pretty cool. There's a weird concept, and I hope they're going to go someplace good with it. In the meantime, yes, she's X-23 again, and I'm very happy for that. So <laughs> like, I know it's a silly thing. It's it, like I understand more than anybody that it's a very silly thing. And yet somehow I just want her to have her own identity, not taking on somebody else's. X-23 was an awesome name. Uh, also, one last thing. I can't remember from the NYX comics. Was Alchemex actually involved in her cloning process? I don't remember Alchemex actually being responsible for that. I thought Alchemex was still something that was in the future only, like the Spider-Man 2099 comics. So, this is weird. I don't know. If it was always there, cool. Let me know either way, please. Comments below. Professor Bill, Comic Book University. Class dismissed.